Democratic presidential candidate Hillary Clinton is selling beer koozies in her official store at HillaryClinton.com. Even though Clinton has demonstrated her lack of support for cannabis law reform, claiming to not have enough information to make a decision on the matter, she is willing to profit from selling paraphernalia for a deadly drug. We already know the damage alcohol does, but this doesn't seem to bother people who are afraid of cannabis legalization. For example, alcohol can cause more than 200 different diseases, including cancer, liver cirrhosis, and alcohol dependence. The drug also kills about 3.3 million people worldwide every year, according to the World Health Organization, 88,000 of which are Americans, according to the CDC. Conversely, in thousands of years, no one has ever died from consuming cannabis. These facts don't stop Clinton from selling beer koozies to support her run for president in 2016, while claiming the effects of cannabis are unknown. While the koozies can obviously be used for non-alcoholic beverages, their main use is clear. Even the Clinton store claims the koozie will make you the coolest person at the party. Maybe the koozies are intended for kids' parties, where sugar and caffeine are the only drugs consumed in the form of soda. But considering children can't vote in the federal election, this seems unlikely. One of the koozies even has a large H, likely meant to stand for Hillary. However, the H could also stand for hospital, where heavy drinkers often end up after consuming too much alcohol. Just imagine the shitstorm if a pro-pot candidate sold bongs or vaporizers in their campaign store. The double standard is glaringly obvious to anyone not suffering from reefer madness.